Hello and welcome to the return of our Tuesday announcements. It is, if you can believe it, almost September um, and almost the beginning of our church program year. Uh, so our announcements are back. And today I have a really special guest with me to um, help me out with the announcements. It's our new director of faith formation, Sadie Con Green, and she's going to introduce her herself. To you all. Hello, everybody. As Allison said, I'm Sadie Congrain, and I'm thrilled to be here as your new Director of Faith Formation. I've met many of you over these past few weeks as I'm getting settled in here and getting the program going, but I'm really looking forward to getting to know all of you starting at the beginning of the church year. And the church year is about to begin, but we have one more summer Sunday service. That's this Sunday, uh, Labor Day weekend. Uh, and Karen Campbell will be leading a service on the topic of hospice. Um, and she works in hospice, so it should be a really wonderful and meaningful service. That's 10 a.m. on this Sunday. And I have a few programs that I'd like and events that I'd like to save the date for and ask you to attend if they apply to you. So the first one is the parent orientation for those who have youth in OWL, and that will be on Thursday, September 7th from 6.30 to 8.30. And the second orientation, it's two parts. We ask you to come to both. The second one will be the following Thursday, Thursday, September 14th. And then I'm excited to meet all of these volunteer teachers. I've talked to some of you on the phone. I've seen some of you in churches services on Sundays, but we will have a teacher training for all of us on September 9th, Saturday from 10 to 2 p.m. And of course, in addition to teachers to help us kick off the program year, we are in need of ushers and greeters for our Sunday services. Um, so we have all kinds of spots open. You can pick your favorite Sunday. It's a really easy way to um, serve the community and a fun way to meet people as well. You get to greet them just as they're coming through the doors. If you are interested in being an usher greeter this fall, uh, the Sign Up Genius is up, and I will put that link in the comments to this video. And on September 10th, Allison and I are leading our All Ages In Gathering Worship Service. We're calling it Enter, Rejoice, and Come In. We will be sharing some of my favorite worship elements in this service, and I look forward to sharing them with all of you. And this will also be the time where we will do our water communion, which is a tradition that many Unitarian Universalist churches all around the country will also be doing on this time of year, where all are invited to bring some water with you to the service, and we will share them with one another and explore what it means to be part of this faith community. Yeah. And we're going to really kick off the year well, because after the service that day, um, we are having a Welcome Sadie potluck party, uh, and um, it's going to be hopefully outside, fingers crossed, for good weather, um, and we need your help to make it happen. So we will have some food that we'll provide. There'll be pulled pork sandwiches, veggie burgers, desserts, water, lemonade, and iced tea. So all of that will already be there. And we are hoping that you can bring salads and side dishes and help us with setting up and cleaning up for that uh, potluck. Uh, again, we have a sign up genius, and I will put that link in the comments as well. The following Sunday is a Sunday I'm also very excited about. It's September 17th. That will be the first day of faith formation classes. I'm, look forward, I'm looking forward to meeting everybody on that day. And we will have another party afterwards. I love that it's a tradition here that you have ice cream, an ice cream social after the first day of faith formation classes. We will do that again this year, sponsored by the faith formation team. And all ages are welcome. Uh, our program is Lifespan. We have an adult faith formation team and a children and youth team. So all are invited to join us for ice cream on hopefully, which will be a beautiful, warm September day. And one way that I'm asking for your help is that 
If you have a child or a teen who would like to be involved in faith formation this year, please register them for the program. So far, I have 31 families who have registered, and that is awesome, but I know there's a few more. So if, if you haven't done that yet, please see the link at the bottom here, and you, you can sign up so we know who to expect and to welcome on our first day of classes. Agreed. Uh, so in addition to all of our faith formation activities starting up this fall, it also some of our musical activities are going to be starting up. Choir is actually um, rehearsing starting tomorrow, uh, Wednesday, August 31st, 30th? 30th. 30th. Tomorrow is Wednesday, August 30th, uh, 7.30 p.m. in the chapel. Uh, and I hope you know by now that our choir is a welcoming community. They love having new members. And they particularly this year need some basses. So if you are someone who sings in that bass range, uh, really think about Think about joining the choir. You can come try it out um, or talk to Jed Holland, our music director, if you have questions. The first singing Sunday for our choir will be that water communion service on September 10th. Uh, the other musical opportunity that's available uh, throughout the year is that we're always looking for instrumentalists who are interested in sharing their talents with us. And so if you play an instrument or sing or would like to do a solo um, or do something with a friend, please contact um, Jed as well for that. September's theme is welcome, and we actually have an opportunity in September, on September 24th. We're looking for some instrumental music. So if you have a song that fits that theme or just something beautiful, let Jed know. We'd love to have you be a part of that service. And our covenant groups are starting up again this fall. Many of our groups that are ongoing still have room for new members, and we have a few new groups that are starting this year. So we would love, if any of you are interested in being involved in covenant groups, to, uh, please sign up. There is a, a link to where you can find more information about covenant groups. And you can sign up there. You can always come talk to me, and I can tell you more about the program and let you know what our covenant groups have to offer. And among all the fun program year stuff coming up, uh, we also have a really joyful event happening in our church on September 16th. Two of our members, Fred Shirley and Andy Rebeck, are getting married, um, and they would like to invite all of their church friends to attend. Everyone is welcome. The wedding will be in the sanctuary at 2 p.m. Saturday, September 16th, with a reception and some light, recept light refreshments to follow in the dining room. Room. All are welcome to come celebrate with Andy and Fred. I'm sure it'll be a really fun day. That's all the announcements we've got for this week. Uh, lots coming up. September is always a busy and fun time here at UU Nashua. Uh, and I'm really excited that this year we get to welcome Sadie as a part of all of that. If you have announcements you want included in next week's announcements, please send them to me before 9 a.m. on Tuesday, and I'll make sure to include them. And in the meantime, I hope you have a wonderful last week of summer, um, and I'm really looking forward to being with you all on September 10th.